Royal Affair. Prince Harry and Prince William attend Star Wars, The Last Jedi premiere in London. IT's one of the most anticipated movies of the year, and Star Wars, The Last Jedi has already smashed the record and it's not even out yet. Star Wars, the Last Jedi has already broken a major record and it's not even in cinemas yet. It debuted on Rotten Tomatoes with the highest ever score for a Star Wars movie, rating 96% or 8. Three tenths on average from about 92 reviews. The score slipped slightly to 94% after further reviews were added but it is still well ahead of other releases in the blockbuster franchise, including 2015 Star Wars, The Force Awakens. 93%. After falling a few points on Rotten Tomatoes, The Last Jedi is currently sitting on par with Star Wars, The Empire Strikes Back, which is widely considered the best Star Wars movie ever made and also has a 94% rating. London Premiere Prince Harry and Prince William turned heads on the red carpet for the UK premiere of Star Wars, The Last Jedi, posing with Stormtroopers and Droid BB-8. The royals are believed to have made a cameo appearance in the movie after filming scenes during a private tour of Pinewood Studios in Buckinghamshire last year, the UK's Telegraph reports. Dressed as stormtroopers, Wills and Harry reportedly give Benicio del Toro a slap on the backside in the uncredited roles. Bond star Daniel Craig had the same cameo, hidden under a stormtrooper costume, in 2015 Star Wars. The Force Awakens. The prince is dressed up in full stormtrooper gear and filmed a scene in which Rey and Finn infiltrate a secret base, a source told the Daily Mail. The rebel characters are in a lift with Benicio del Toro's character when a group of stormtroopers enter. Two of them are William and Harry. Harry and Wills were joined by Daisy Ridley, Adam Driver and Mark Hamill at Royal Albert Hall in London. Ridley, 25, who plays Jedi Rey in the latest Star Wars installment sported a black Calvin Klein dress with an asymmetric neckline as she posed with co-star Hamill, who plays Luke Skywalker. I actually felt more nervous because I didn't know what I was doing the first time around, and you kind of think, how am I supposed to do something again when I didn't know what I did the first time, Ridley said, according to the Daily Mail. And I think because people responded so well to, co-star, John, Boyega, and I together that was a big thing too thinking how are people going to respond when we're not together. So it was nerve-wracking. But again, as relationships grow and you start to get comfortable, it settles into a wonderful six months. Fresh from his engagement to Meghan Markle, Prince Harry was accompanied by his brother Prince William to the premiere, also attended by Star Wars favorites Capo and R2-D2.